it is in terms of an attack that Israel could have planned on Iranian soil about the most limited you could have had. Oh. There were those hawks in Israel who would have liked to see an all-out attack, and there were some in the US also urging this, an all-out attack on um, Iran's nuclear facilities. That has not happened. It's not attacked anything civilian. It is a very limited attack on a military facility, we think, and an attack that has been repelled, that has been shot down. It's being downplayed by the Iranians, so that's all good news yeah. in terms of potential escalation. The thing to worry about is this was an attack on Iranian soil and Iran had made statements about that before. They said any further military action by Israel will be met by an immediate um, response on a massive scale, maximum, maximum level, I think, mm. were the words of the foreign minister speaking at the UN just hours before this attack. I, I think there'll now be lots of back channels being worked because, remember, the US and Iran don't talk to each other but there are other intermediaries, other countries that do talk to both sides. Look, I think, uh, to the Turks, mm -hmm. look to the Gulf countries, and in particular, Oman has been, has been the place that's mm -hmm. been a, uh, an important back channel between the US and Iran in the past.